Bonjour from France. This is another episode of Hiking with QS. And once again, I will be doing a very epic hike, seven days tour du Mont Blanc. One round that spans three countries, France, Italy, and Switzerland. And we'll be crossing different mountain passes. Follow me. Day 6 of 7 of the Tour du Mont Blanc, I just had breakfast at Refuge Le Petit and this is one of the best refuges so far. The food is amazing. You have like 20 plus people sleeping together so that's quite an experience. So we're gonna head towards Col du Balm and then I'm gonna head all the way down to Trilicham. I'm doing two stages today so I have to rush. Let's go! Five minutes after the ascent, there's a fallen tree. So just be careful on your way to call the bomb. We have reached refuge called the bomb. Time now is about nine. There's a variant and traditional route. So I'm gonna do a bit of research before I go. I have decided to go on the trail with the Aguili de Posed. I'm not sure if it's, this is the official route or the variant but it feels like this route is gonna be more things to see if I head to the tour I'll be down right down at the little town over there which I think I will be seeing quite a bit later on so let's head towards Aguili the Museum the other side as well on to Lac Blanc if the weather permits the descent down has been mostly very safe a lot of wooden planks built as steps you don't have to worry too much about the rocky path I just met a lovely couple they are going around with this tape marking they are marking the whole route for everyone I have arrived at Auberge La Bourne, one of the refuge along the Tour du Mont Blanc and I think I will have a little bite over here before I carry on. Time now is 12.45, I've just completed my lunch. Let's do the La Blanc climb. It's about a thousand meters to ascend. somewhere near really the Ankentier and this is the ladder section I think it should be fine I'm not sure if there are more up there if you are afraid of heights uh, the ladder might not be the a good thing for you you can see all the way down so I'm just left with a small section upwards and we'll be good there are also some bars that you have to step on the horizontal section of a rock that one is a uh, quite scary when you thought you completed the ladder section which actually took quite a while I see one more section of ladder up there looks like there are a lot of ladders over here I am standing here at Tete Auvergne and this gives you the full view of the Mont Blanc Massif we are about 40 minutes to Lac Blanc let's go you can see a very greenish blue color the very clear water over here the way to refuge Lac Blanc is still covered in snow that's a pretty short section I think it's pretty doable right behind me is refuge Lac Blanc it's still full of snow as you can see Lac Blanc you can see the very bright blue color of the water on the ice I'm on my way down to La Flecleur. You can see a crowd here. They're looking at an Ibex. I 
I have reached the Fligir cable car station. This is a cable car that takes you back to Chamonix Le Pro. It's been a really tough day for me. It's almost 5. I think it's still 4.30 something. This is a huge deluxe view. Let me show you. This is the main area. This looks like a dining area. Upstairs, these are the rooms. My room is over here. And that's where I'm sleeping. So it's time to rest. Day six accomplished.